Hi, I'm in Providence, Rhode Island in Roger Williams National Memorial. And this well right here represents the site where a natural spring was located. Uh, in the 17th century, there was a man living in Boston named Roger Williams. And by the standards of the day, you would say that he was insane. He believed crazy things like that government shouldn't de decide people's religion, that Native Americans should be traded with and treated with equally and not wiped out, and that people had the freedom to choose how and where and why they wanted to worship. These all might not seem too crazy to us, but at the time it was enough to get him kicked out of Boston. Now, they wanted to send him back to England for trial and punishment and possible execution, but he was able to escape out into the wilderness. Now, he wasn't alone. He had a few followers that thought that he might have been on to something, and he and those followers made their way about halfway between the Boston colony and the Manhattan colony and settled here near the confluence of two rivers where there's a good healthy coastline, a nice harbor, a nice hill, and a fresh water source. They started the town of Providence. And in the town of Providence, people were free to worship as they wanted. That even included Quakers that uh, Roger Williams really hated. He did not like the Quakers, but he welcomed them into his town and permitted them to worship as they liked. So he really was, in many ways, presaging a lot of the characteristics and qualities that would define the U.S. Constitution and the Bill of Rights. Now, he wasn't perfect. After King Philip's War, he would be involved in selling some Native Americans into slavery. So, yikes. But he was really interested in Native American culture. He wrote one of the first books about the language of the Native Americans and treated them pretty fairly and was had an excellent relationship with the tribes that lived in this area. And today this whole park in Providence is a monument to his achievements. Mm -hmm.